guys, welcome to my channel. This series of videos will be unboxing videos for my new gaming PC. You can also check out the links below for my live stream channels. Also, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and click the notification bell to be notified each and every time that I post a new video. And with that said, let's get started. Today's unboxing video is going to be for the Corsair's Dominator Platinum 64GB memory kit with RGB fans. This retails for $1,025. I did get mine off of Amazon for $5.99. Uh, that was such a steal for me uh, compared to the memory that I was going to buy. I decided to pick this one up. It is a bit overkill, but for the price, it's way worth it. This does um, have ball bearing PWM fans, DHX cooling technology. You will need the Cosair Link Commander um, to be able to um, monitor your temperature and to adjust your lighting. The default color uh, for the RGB fans in here are, uh, is red. So if you want to be able to change it to, to match the rest of your lighting um, inside your PC, you'll have to have that, which is sold separately have my scissors right here. I'm going to go ahead and cut the seal. As you can see, there are two layers to this. Packaging feels really nice and looks really nice. Okay. So those are the two layers that were in the box. We have four eight gigabyte sticks here and uh, one of the RGB fans. So one fan goes to four sticks. And then here's the second layer, same thing, four eight gigabyte um, sticks and the fan to control those as well. Um, so let me go ahead and pick this up here. And you can see it's very pretty, very sleek. Then I'll go ahead and pick up one of the fans. So this is what it looks like. And then there's the cable to attach it. This is really, really pretty. I'm super excited about this. I'm actually going to be installing this tonight. Um, I will be posting um, pictures on my Instagram and possibly a video of what I've got accomplished so far uh, in my build. Um, I will provide the link from Amazon um, in the description bar below if you guys wanted to go on there and see if this is still available for $5.99. Like I said, it's a steal. Um, so for now, that's it. And until next time, I'll see you then. All right, this is why I do my unboxing videos because I am installing uh, the memory kit right now, as I mentioned previously, um, but it looks like I missed a box and some brackets and screws that were underneath each level here, so I'm showing you those now. Uh, let me go ahead and open up this box and see what's in here. Okay, it looks like a manual. Okay, you get your cables for power and fans. Looks like. Yeah. Okay. There's two of those. Okay. Oh, this looks like a Node Pro with mounting tape. Okay, so this is very interesting. This was not mentioned um, anywhere on the box. Uh, so this is why we do unboxing videos because you know, you never know what little surprises you're going to get. So I actually won't need to purchase a Corsair Link Commander. I can just go 
on the website and download the Corsair Link software and be able to uh, use my RGB fans the way they're supposed to be used, which is awesome. So I'm gonna go ahead and continue um, installing and then give y'all a quick shot of it afterwards. This is what I have so far. As you can see, I have the uh, memory kit installed with the two RGB fans. One thing that's really annoying me right now is the hoses from the radiator to the pump are really pushing up against this fan right here. I actually had to zip tie back here. You can't really see it to keep it from making the fan crooked. So that's annoying me right now. I may try to figure something out a little bit later. Um, I did want you guys to see these. These are the three pin extension uh, cables for the fans. I didn't need to use these, so I'm just gonna keep them. Um, so now I'm gonna go around the back and show you how I installed. Well, I didn't completely install it, um, but where I put the uh, Node Pro at, um, I have not installed my power supply because it's extremely heavy um, and it will make it difficult for me to move the case around while I'm installing different parts, so that will be last. Uh, but hang tight, let me go to the back and I'll show you. As you can see, there's the Node Pro right there. It's not glued down or anything just yet. Like I said, I need to finish uh, putting on the other parts and the power supply. Um, for those of you who have not uh, seen my unboxing video for this case, this is the Cooler Master Cosmos C700M with addressable RGB lighting. It's a beautiful case. You should go watch my unboxing video. Um, and I know this thing is going to be extremely pretty once it's all put together. Until next time, see you then.